Hello everybody! I'm going to give you a quick demonstration of the new feature that we have added to QTCP tools and it is encryption. And I'm also going to show you a new tool called Qt KDM Maker that creates KDMs for cinemas so that your encrypted DCP can be played. Uh, we are going to import a short trailer, it's one minute duration. And here we have our DCP. And this is a certificate for the cinema that where we are going to show the encrypted DCP. So let's start to import the DCP. Select it and, and now it's imported. The next thing to do is to encrypt it. Select the DCP folder and go to export QTSB tool repackage. I stick to the same composition name. The only thing I'm going to do is to check this box, repackage and encrypt. This text field is a path to the key storage file that are going to be created when we are encrypting the DCP. This file holds all keys that are used for encryption. But I leave this one empty for now. It will be filled out automatically and the key file is stored by default next to the DCP. I'm just going to give my DCP output folder a different name so we can differentiate it from my original DCP folder name. And now it's filled out and we are starting the encryption process. And this is real time. It's now done. Let's go back to um, the folder. Here we have our original DCP and this is the encrypted one. This is a certificate for the cinema and this is the extra special file that holds all keys that is used for encryption. We are going to use this file when we are creating the KDMs together with the cinema certificate. So let's open our new application, Qt KDM Maker. Okay, so let's start to add our key storage file that holds all um, keys that is used for encryption. And here we are going to select our cinema certificate. We have two options here. We can select a single file. We only have one buff file, so we are going to select that. Uh, uh, if you have a folder with a lot of mm, cinema certificates we can process them in one go by selecting just the folder but we are just picking a single certificate and the output location I'm just store them here and press generate created let's take a look at our created KDM here we have it right here this is how simple it could be to encrypt the DCP and create a KDM for a specific cinema. Alright, cheers, bye.